Dear colleagues, dear friends, the year 2020 was, in the history of Group ADP, one of the most challenging and was marked by an exceptionally widespread and long crisis. The world of aviation may be used to dealing with this crisis, but this one has affected every country, every airport, all our business without exception or distinction. Since the start of the year, traffic in Group ADP has dropped by 61% compared to 2019, and we welcomed 88.2 million passengers to all our airports. But considering these challenges, we have equipped ourselves with the means required to face them, and all our airports showed a remarkable capacity to adapt by implementing exceptional measures. Together, we managed to avoid the worst case scenario and we held the line. This is thanks to each one of you. I'm very proud, I'm very grateful for your commitment, your sense of responsibility and your tremendous resilience. You demonstrated, once again, your ability to react, adapt, and support one another in the face of adversity. In the context of this crisis, I'm particularly proud of several measures that were implemented in our network. I would like to briefly outline three of them. Firstly, the implementation of health measures. The health and safety of our passengers and employees is our group's top priority. I applaud all the initiatives taken in our terminals to help passengers feel safer. These include the installation of thermal cameras, testing facilities, the reorganization of the passenger's journey, as well as many other innovative measures. 20 Group ADP airports have recently obtained the SEI Airport Health Accreditation, and eight others are expecting to receive this accreditation soon. Secondly, I would like to emphasize the energy of the cargo sector, which played a key role in responding to the global health emergency. Millions of masks, pharmaceutical products, and protective equipment have been shipped all over the world. Third, I would also like to add a word about Group ADP's ambitions and its pursuit of strategic goals set before the crisis. Despite all the difficulties we faced, we can celebrate several successes. Group ADP has reinforced its position as the world's leading airport group. Firstly, we have acquired 49% of the share capital of the GMR Airports Group, and signed a strong industrial partnership with our Indian friends. TAV Airports acquired the Almaty International Airport in Kazakhstan, and we signed the concession agreement for the new international airport of Gbesia Conakry with the Republic of Guinea. Our technical assistant contracts in Mauritius and Jeddah have been renewed for another year, and both The Santiago teams and Amman teams have been very active in restoring the economic conditions of their concession. Major construction works and projects have also been completed to prepare our airports for the future, such as the new 17,000 square meter terminal in Madagascar and the spectacular modernization of Cotonou Airport. Furthermore, we have persevered with the major construction site in Chile despite the very difficult political and health situation there. Group ADP has reinforced its commitment to protecting the climate and environment, as demonstrated by the renewal of Amman Airport's carbon neutrality certification until 2022, making it the only airport in the region to have reached this level of environmental efficiency. We also have improved our performance in terms of welcome and hospitality. As you know, it is one of my priority. It has been recognized in the latest Skytrax ratings, where six of our airports have been ranked among the top 100 in the world. 
as you know very well, being the world's leading airport group is a great asset, putting us in a very fortunate position to go through the current crisis. Moreover, by signing the Airport Force Trust Charter, which concerns 23 of the group airports, we demonstrated our ability to reinvent our industrial model, design and build the airport of the future, while remaining focused on our environmental, social and corporate responsibility. Dear friends, dear colleagues, 2021 is still uncertain for sure with regards to the resumption of traffic. Recovery will take time, but have no doubt that it will happen. The year ahead also brings hope. The COVID-19 vaccine campaigns, which have been launched all over the world, will enable air travel to pick up again. We must stand united at this crucial time and remember that we have all the need for success. We must already start preparing Group ADP for the challenges of tomorrow and continue to create a new, agile and sustainable airport model. We will overcome these challenges together. I wish each of you, each of your families, everyone, a very happy and successful new year. And please, take care of our customers and of yourselves. Thank you very much.